Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today I'll be using this Bruno Model 2E, which was uh, made in 1985, which is a 22 room fire uh, caliber rifle, which is probably CZ by then because I know it burnt down at some stage. So this example is in pretty good nick. It uh, would have generally have came with a five round magazine, but I've got a 10 round in this one. And we've got up to 200 meters or yards with uh, an iron sight. It sort of looks like military style. Behind me, there's a couple of cans that we'll be shooting at today and see how accurate it is uh, while standing up. I hope you enjoy. that one I think I hit that one yeah I got it I pulled that shot <laughs> Underneath, I think. Yeah, hit the bottom of it. And uh, so it's pretty easy at about, what is that, 25, 30 meters. We'll uh, go move back a little bit and we'll see uh, how accurate it is then. So now I've got about five rounds of uh, subsonics to see how well they run in with the uh, iron sights, whether or not I need to move it up or... It's so quiet. I see the coke hiding there. One by itself on the top there. It went through. Where is he? Give him another one. There he is. Missed him. The reason why I use uh, water bottles or cans in most of my videos is because generally they explode like a, as a reactive target and uh, hopefully hopefully it's easy to catch on camera. Got him. There's that hidden yellow one. Just above those other ones. I 
think it is for time. So overall I found the uh, subsonics to be far more accurate than the high velocities. Um, it's overall it's a nice rifle. If you can ever get your hands on one, you, I'd recommend it. Probably the Model 1 over the Model 2. So uh, thanks for watching and have a good one.